Let's find the integral of 1 over x times the square root of x to the fourth minus 16 dx. So let's make a substitution. Let u equal the square root of x to the fourth minus 16, which is just x to the fourth minus 16 raised to the one half power. And we'll use a chain rule to take the derivative of this. So bring down the power, keep the inside the same, and then take the derivative of the inside. So right now, I guess if we were to rewrite this, let's clean it up. We have one over, well, four times a half is two. So there should be two up here. X cubed over the square root of X to the fourth minus 16 DX. And I'm going to move the two X cubed to the other side. And that will be DX over the square root of X to the fourth minus 16, which is going to be right here. So that's going to get replaced with uh, 1 over 2x cubed du. The 1 half, we can bring it outside. That's 1 half. And then 1 over x times 1 over x cubed is 1 over x to the fourth. But recall that u is equal to the square root of x to the fourth minus 16. So if I square both sides and then add 16, I'm able to solve for x to the fourth. So that's one over u squared plus 16. Now in order to solve the integral, we have to make a substitution. So ideally what I would want it, well, what I want to happen is to have 16 v squared plus 16 so then I can factor out the 16 and have 1 over v squared plus 1 because that's just arc tangent. So we want u squared to equal 16 v squared. So if I take the square root of both sides, I get u is 4v or v is u over 4. So that's going to be our substitution. So dv is 1 fourth du. So you have one half integral one over so u squared it we said is uh, 16 v squared from over here and then du is 4 dv so this 4 will come outside and multiply the one half to get 2 then I'm going to factor out the 16 so 2 over 16 becomes 1 eighth integral 1 over v squared plus 1 dv. The antiderivative of that is arctangent of v plus a constant c. But recall that v was u over 4, so we'll replace that with u over 4. And then u, we said it was a square root of x squared minus, or square root of x to the fourth minus 16. So we'll replace that. And so this is our final answer.